Virginia Torres has lived at this home on South 22nd for three decades. A lot of people's gone and come and I'm still here, but I like it. Over the years, it's gotten harder and harder for Torres to take care of her home. My roof was leaking. I was getting water in the house. One of my grandkids come over and said one day, Grandma, you better put out another pan. <laughs> better than a pan is Project Housework, a local nonprofit. I would never get it done. The house would probably fall apart by then. Instead, for no cost, Torres has a new roof and modified bathroom. Our hope is that they stay in their home. Project Housework is getting extra muscle by teaming up with Brush of Nebraska. In the past three decades, volunteers with the group have painted nearly 3,000 homes. This home hasn't had a fresh coat of paint in well over 30 years, and they need volunteer help to restore homes just like this all over the metro. Founders Tom and Sheila Pettigrew say they need at least 1,400 volunteers for paint day. The reward? I mean, you go by and you look at and the teams. I think that's one thing that makes the volunteers feel so good is at the end of the day, they have this beautiful new looking house. This year will be bittersweet for the Pettigrews. It's Brush Up's 30th anniversary and the couple is retiring. It has never been a chore. Um, we've gotten through 30 years and yeah, maybe we're getting to the point where it's a little more difficult for us, but uh, we, we've been through everything, so there's nothing that surprises us. And now, with Project Housework and Brush Up Nebraska merging, more low-income seniors can get the help they need. Torres loves the improvement so far and is eager for August when her house gets a new coat. A light, light blue or mint green.